Well, uh, American Junior Golf Association has a you know has a legacy of being the premier junior golf uh, tour, um, and have some personal relationship with uh, with the sport, and and so I'm familiar with the prestige around it. Haven't had an event in Colorado Springs, so we were really excited when um, when we learned that there was interest in bringing an event here. Um, as an organization, we're a healthcare organization. We're not just about sickness care; we're about wellness and um, promoting health and wellness, uh, physical activity, and so. Um, we, we frequently will sponsor events that, uh, that encourage that kind of lifestyle. So again, we were just super excited to partner and, uh, and be able to help bring this great event to Colorado Springs. Well, we, um, you know, we obviously care, care for uh, individuals from, from the cradle to the grave. And uh, golf is such a great example of a sport that, uh, uh, that, that you can take your entire life. And I, my hope for these kids is that they, they love the game as much as they do now uh, when they're well into retirement. And so this is, an, this is an opportunity to support that kind of lifestyle in individuals and create habits that'll stick with them for life. Absolutely. And, and you know, we also have other, um, you know, we, we also use this as an opportunity to promote some of our um, programs. We have uh, the William J. Hibble Sports Medicine and uh, Performance Center, which is a world-class facility that we opened up last year as part of the City for Champions initiative. Um, and we have a golf assessment and fitness program that we're hoping to promote as well. Um, so there's definitely synergies there as well. Oh, absolutely. Well, um, you know, we put this one together fairly quickly. Uh, COVID had an impact on all of us. And so um, I'm looking forward to having a little bit more time, get more involvement uh, from myself and folks on my team. This course is a fantastic course. It's one of the premier courses in the in the area and it's only gonna get better. It's only been open for a couple of years. So um, in addition to gratitude to the AJGA, um, also a big gratitude to the membership at Flying Horse that uh, was supportive of giving up their course for five days. Uh, you know, we, uh, we believe in, pro in whole person care at Centura Health, uh, mind, body, and spirit. And so we spend a lot of time, too much of our time in healthcare. And I mean, the United States healthcare system spends too much time on sickness care. So anything we can do to promote individuals, um, you know, creating habits that keep them well is good for all of us. Well, I'd just start with congratulations because I've been watching some of these scores and these kids are unbelievable golfers. I, want, I'm, I was meaning to ask if we set a course record here or not this week, but uh, uh, no, just uh, I hope they all had a great time and I, and I look forward to next year because it's going to keep getting better and better.